Hello, my name is Iman Firuzi and I'm the Global Product Manager for Distribution and Industrial Protection and Control Products, including the 3 Series at GE. It's my pleasure to share our vision with you for the 3 Series platform. The 3 Series provides economical protection and control solutions for feeders, motors and transformers. Its features allow users to uh, utilize the 3 Series for applications spanning from a simple overcurrent feeder to motor protection and transformer differential or even backup protection in various voltage levels. This short video will give you an overview of the many capabilities this terrific relay has to offer. Thank you for watching and good luck with your studies. Welcome to 3 Series Overview Training Modules. Here is what's covered in this module. Introduction Hardware Software Features Applications Function Block and NC Code Order Code In the beginning, we'll give a brief introduction of 3 Series. So, what is 3 Series? 3 Series Protection Relay is a highly functional economical protection relay for the utility and industrial, for the low, medium, and high voltage applications. 3 Series Relays effectively eliminate the need for expensive, discrete components. 3 Series Relay has three types of relays for the protections of feeder, motor, and transformer. 350 can also be used in capacitor bank protection. The relay can be operated from the front panel or with intuitive configuration software and Vista, locally or remotely. There are 16 programmable logic elements provide great application flexibility. Arc flash mitigation via zone into tripping flex curves and multiple elements and setting groups. Relays has advanced switchgear monitoring and relay health diagnostic information. 3 Series support multiple communication protocols including IEC 61850, 61850 GOOSE, MADBUS, TCP IP, Mudbus RTU, DNP 3.0, IEC 60870-5-104-103, and OPC-UA, IEC 62-541, IEC 62-439-3, PRP, and HSR. IEEE 15 88 PTP. 3 Series Relay Warranty is 10 years as all G Motlin relays. Next, we'll talk about the hardware of the relay. There are two types of the front panel for 3 Series draw out and non draw out. Both can simplify the commissioning and maintenance. For the draw out type, the relay can be removed from the CNC with the wiring still connected. For the non draw out type, the wiring can be pre wired to the Euro style terminal blocks, then plug into the relay. The size of the front panel is 203 mm by 158 mm. The rear side size is 173 mm by 101 mm. The depth of the relay is 200 mm. The product identification label is located on the side panel of the relay. This label indicates the product model, serial number, and date of manufacture. In the front panel, 3 Series has 4 lines by 20 characters LCD display allows visibility under varied lighting conditions. There are 10 or 12 color-coded LEDs to indicate the type of event. Below the LEDs, there are 10 push-button keypad for access to device, interrogation, change of setting, and control commands. At the bottom, 
USB port allows the user to do the quick connection with AntVista software. Most 3-series relays have one copper and one fiber Ethernet ports. The AltaCode with 5E will have two fiber Ethernet ports. For the draw-out type relay, columns A, B are for output relays. Column C is for digital inputs. Columns D, E are for CT, VT inputs. Column F is for communications, RS485, and IRIGB inputs. For the non draw-out type relay, columns A is for output relays. Column B is for digital inputs. Column C is for communications. Columns D, E are for the CT, VT inputs. Now, let's take a look of the software. The NVista SR3 setup software is one software works for three types of the relays. It can program and modify settings, read and write setting files, read metering values and monitor status, read pre-trip, transient and event records for post-mortem analysis, upgrade three series relay firmware, and each relay has its own firmware. And Vista SR3 setup works under Windows 7, Windows 8, and Windows 10. M2 family relays, MIF, MIV setting files can be imported into 3 series platform. There are six types of configurable input gates OR, AND, NOR, NAND. Exclusive OR and Exclusive NOR. The number of gate inputs of trigger is 8 and 4 for the block sources. One or ON flag ended as trigger or block source. Quick setup allows user to config main settings from different screens in a common window. Relay status, nominal frequency, current sensing, voltage sensing, configuration of main protection like phase, ground, neutral, time over current, and instantaneous over current. Protection summary use one single screen to show summarized information of settings for protection and control elements, output relay assignments for the elements. User can view the enable, disable status of control elements as well as navigate to the respected protection element screen on one button click. Event recorder of one millisecond time stamping records the sequence of events and relevant parameters. Transient record captures the waveform as an instance of element operation input or manual command. The fault report captures analog signals of the time of the trip, stores the last recorded values in non-volatile memory. Now, let's summarize the features of 3 series. Extended and enhanced protection and control features. Positive sequence under voltage. Second, harmonic blocking to avoid unwanted trips during normal operations. Dedicated 10 inputs lockout through non-volatile latch to simplify logic for lockout operation. 3-series can monitor the integrity of both the breaker trip and the closing coils and circuits. It also monitors the breaker operation parameters like tripping, closing, and spring charging time. Number of permissible operations, magnitude of breaking current, mechanical wear and contact wear, CT fuel separation and VT fuel fuel separation are provided to avoid undesired operation of some protection elements. Wide input ranges for CT VT. 350 phase CT primary is up to 6000 amps and VT ratio range is 5000 which means permissible primary VT voltage can be reached to 550 kilovolts. 
Test mode can test the front panel LEDs and outputs without external test equipment. Universal CT available for the non out relay and CT secondary is software selectable. So there's less order code and more flexibility for future design change. Programmable LED is available. User can customize the LED display. M2 family migration to 3 series platform is simplified with retrofit tools and setting file conversion in the software. Now we come to the application of 3 series. There are three types of 3 series relays. 350 is used for feeder protection in medium voltage and high voltage utility and industrial. It can be changed to a voltage relay by changing the order code and also it can be used for capacitor bank protection. 339 is used for the protection of low voltage and medium voltage motors of various sizes. 345 is used for the protection of two winding power transformer, reactors and auto transformers. Let's go to more detailed protection elements of each relay by looking the function block and NC code. In the 350 functional block diagram, we can see the phase current protection element 50 and 51, IOC and TOC, and also the cable thermal 49 and the directional elements and there's also the ground protection for the 50G and 51G. For the voltage element it has the 24 volts per hertz, under over voltage and under over frequency and also there's a synchro check 25 element. Um, for the Power directional 32, it uses both the current and voltage signal, same like the overcurrent directional. And it also has the control element uh, 79, auto reclose. It controls the breaker to be auto reclose after a transient fault. In the 339 functional block diagram, we can see it has the voltage element from the VT uh, under and over voltage. It has the phase reversal and also the frequency element over and under frequency. It has the 32 uh, power directional and from the uh, CT side it feeds to the current elements with typical motor protection um, 37 under current, 46 on balance, 48 acceleration time, and the main protection is 49, the thermal model. Also, it has a regular uh, overcurrent protection, 50 and 51 instantaneous, and time overcurrent. And uh, it has the 38, the bearing RTD inputs, and also the 86 um, start inhibit and also 66 is the starting rate of the motor. In the 345 functional block diagram, we can see there is no VT input, so there's only the current elements. The main protection is 87T, the person differential. There's also another 87G for the RGF, restricted ground faults and mostly other elements are the regular uh, current elements like a 50, 51, instantaneous and time over current on both winding 1 and winding 2. The ANSI code for each type of the 3 series relays is summarized in this comparison table. So from this table we can see the each type of relay, what functions are available, and also for the IEC 61850 logical node is also provided in this table. 
Um, for example, we can see that the current element um, 50 P, 50 breaker failure, BF, uh, neutral and ground uh, negative sequence, these are common for the all three relays. Same for the is, uh, time over current, phase and neutral and ground. And some protection element uh, just uh, very unique uh, for certain protection. So for example, the motor protection got its uh, undercurrent, under power, and RTD uh, unbalance, current unbalance. For the transformer, um, it has its uh, unique protection is the differential. It has the person differential and also the restricted Restricted ground faults, 87G. Um, there's one element, 49 thermal model. It's uh, shown here for all three relays, but there's some difference between each type of relay. For the feeder relay, the thermal model is uh, cable thermal. And for the 339 motor, it's a uh, motor thermal model. And the transformer has a, it's a, transformer thermal model. So each uh, uh, calculation, the algorithm is uh, slightly different. Um, so that's the whole comparison of uh, all three relays. So if you want to go to more detailed information, for example, the thermal model, you can go to the manual for the detailed uh, uh, description of uh, that uh, function. Lastly, I will demonstrate how to use online store to configure the order code for 350 relay. Now I'm going to demonstrate how to use online store tools to configure the order code for 3 series relay. So first we go to the G website store.gdigitalenergy.com and in the search type 350 and search for 350 feeder relay. Then we click uh, 350 feeder protection relay buy now button. And from this configuration tool, we can see this product options below. So by selecting each options, you can automatically update the order code on the top. For example, if I want to select the current protection to be advanced configuration, I just select uh, from letter E to letter M and then order code is automatically updated on the top. And this is the good way to config a valid order code because uh, there are some contradictions between the each letters. So this way will guarantee you create a valid order code for the three series relay. Now let's recap what we learned in this overview module. Three series relay is a cost effective relay. It has three applications easy to use and in hardware it has non-drawout and drawout two type of different front panel and different rail side. And Vista SR3 setup software can be used for three type of the relay. There are enhanced protection and controls including the positive sequence on the voltage, logic element and arc flange. The diagnostic and the monitoring information is available and also CTVT supervision. There's a flex flexible universal CT and programmable LEDs. There's a multiple advanced communication protocols. So that concludes this uh, overview modules of 3 series. Thanks for watching.